Hello everyone, I am Johnson. Today, let's learn how to create Quick Action Buttons navigation. Quick Action Buttons are a common design pattern in mobile interfaces. They refer to a set of related action buttons that are prominently placed on the screen, allowing users to quickly access commonly used functions. The main characteristics of Quick Action Buttons are Fixed position, usually located at the top or bottom of the screen. Simple button styles, using icons to represent the functions. Strong relevance to the current page or content, typically used for quick actions related to the current context. Limited in number, usually consisting of three to five buttons. Compact layout, maximizing the use of limited space to display more functions. Let's now learn how to create quick action buttons navigation. We will create a functionality similar to viewing photos in the iOS photo gallery. In the bottom quick action buttons bar, you can quickly perform actions on the photos. First, drag in a dynamic panel to hold the image. Adjust its size to leave space for the bottom quick action buttons bar. Then, enter the dynamic panel and drag in an image widget. Double click to import the image and choose optimize the image. Next, drag in a rectangle to create the background for the quick action buttons. Switch to the icons library and search for and drag in the share, heart, info, and delete icons. Select them and align them horizontally and vertically in the center. Then, drag in a rectangle to create the background for the share panel. Adjust its border color and visibility. Drag in an ellipse to represent the share icon. Duplicate it four times. Create it as a dynamic panel and select horizontal scrolling from the right click menu. Drag in a heading and change the text to share. Create it as a dynamic panel and name it share. Pin it to the horizontal center and vertical bottom of the browser. Set it to hidden. Then, drag it horizontally to the side. Select the heart icon, add a selected style effect, and change the fill color to red. Next, drag in a rectangle to create the background for the info panel. Then, drag in a heading and change the text to info. Set the border color and visibility of the rectangle. Create them as dynamic panels. Drag in a rectangle and enter text to represent the content. Pin it to the horizontal center and vertical bottom of the browser. Set it to hidden. Next, drag in a dynamic panel to create the delete panel. Drag in a button.
change the text color to red. Then, drag in another button and change the text to cancel. Change the above button text to delete photo. Set a background color for the dynamic panel. Use a semi-transparent black color. Pin it to the horizontal center and vertical bottom of the browser. Set it to hidden. Then, move it horizontally to another position. Name it delete. Name the info dynamic panel as info. Next, let's set up the interactions. Select the share button. Add a click interaction to show the share dynamic panel. Add a 200 millisecond slide up animation. Select treat as light box and add a semi-transparent black color to the scrim. Select the heart button. Add a click interaction to toggle the selection of this widget. Select the info button. Add a click interaction to show the info dynamic panel. Add a 200 millisecond slide up animation. Move the Y axis of the image dynamic panel by minus 100. Add an animation. Set the image dynamic panel selection state to true. Here, we need to add a condition, is selected of this equals value false to determine the position of the image based on its selection state. Then, add a swipe down interaction to the image dynamic panel. Here, we need to add a condition, is selected of this equals value true. Move the Y axis of the image dynamic panel by 100. Add an animation. Hide the info panel. Add a slide down animation. Set this widget selection state to false. Next, add a swipe down interaction to the info dynamic panel, fire event. Select the image dynamic panel as the target and choose swipe down as the event. Then, select the delete icon. Add a click interaction to show the delete dynamic panel. Add a slide up animation. Select Treat as Lightbox. Next, select the Delete Photo button in the Delete Dynamic Panel. Add a click interaction to hide the Delete Dynamic Panel. Then, copy and paste the interaction to the Cancel button. Finally, add a click interaction to the icons in the Share Panel to hide the Share Panel. Preview the prototype. Click the share button to show the share panel. You can horizontally scroll the buttons. Click any button in the panel to hide the share panel. Click the like icon to toggle the selection of the like icon. Click the info button to move the image upward and show the info panel. Swipe down on the image or info panel to move the image downward and hide the info panel. Click the delete button to show the delete photo and cancel buttons. Click any button to hide the delete panel. If you like my video, please give me a like and subscribe to my channel.